Let's go ahead and stop off at Cisco for some high school football. The Lobos came up one point short on their first state title school hits in school history or their run to the state title last December. We turn to Brandon Ortega to see what it's going to take for a shot at redemption. In front of over 10,000 fans on the biggest stage in the state of Texas, the Lobos came up that short and the 2011 state title was out of Cisco's hands. Everyone on the team still watches that tape. I watch it re pretty regularly, and you know, you go back and look at it, and there's a lot of things that you wish you would have done different. I remember thinking back in the middle of the year when we were thinking about how amazing it would be to be able to make it that far into the cow play and play in the Cowboys Stadium as a team for the state finalists, and. It, it was an, ama an amazing ride. Last season marked the fourth time since 2002 the Lobos had reached a state final. This season, only a handful of returners are back on each side of the ball, so junior Mason Reed and senior Colton Gale will be heavily relied on to lead the underclassmen. This year, our scheme's gonna have to be a little different because of the youth and size uh, uh, that, that's stepping into those shoes. We're experienced in the backfield. We're experienced in the secondary, and those are those are some issues that, that I, I think we'll, we'll see in the scrimmages. The receiving game, actually, Throwing and catching the ball has really impressed me. Uh, we're throwing and catching really good. Brandon Ortega, K Texas Sports.